It is Wednesday afternoon. I just got back and am about to take Barley for her walk. It is beautiful outside, close to 80 degrees. And I will be going to my new home tonight just to drop a few things off. Uh, Non-furniture things, I am trying to pretty much cram as much as I can in some of these boxes and move things gradually until Friday. That way Friday is just furniture and nothing else if possible. Um, I do think I have done a pretty good job at keeping things minimal. I just have some things in drawers, my kitchen stuff, and my clothes. So I think my clothes and kitchen stuff I'll bring Thursday night. That way I'm not still needing to use any of it before I pretty much remove everything. But yeah, the day's almost here. I'm really excited. The walk is a much needed break from work, even though I have been pretty much doing stuff on my own in the morning. I just hope that after lunch there isn't anything that could suddenly make the day go south. But yeah, so far it's a pretty good day. I will try to stay optimistic if possible. Yummy. So nice to see all my children during my lunch break. Right, Milo? Ooh. Oh. Knocked you down good. Whoa, whoa. Careful. No nose to lens. Hmm. I did actually want to walk longer just because it is absolutely beautiful out, but the places, <laughs> the places I like to walk her in are the neighborhood areas where there's less people and those areas have no shade against the harsh sun and since she is a Siberian, right pups? Riley, good. Always so, so shy for eye contact. But yes, she has that coat, so I would feel bad if the sun was beating down on her the whole time. Right? Fucking cat, I swear to God. Someone's nervous. <laughs> Funny. I am deciding to make a quick trip to bubble tea before I go back to work. So the thing about that is that I usually try to go during either lunchtime on a weekday or on the weekend, I go right when it opens at 11 in the morning. Those are pretty much the times where you can make sure that there is very minimal lines. And yeah, I, uh, I feel like I hate lines that much that I really try to go during times where I am pretty certain that there just aren't any. I think it's the same concept between trying to go grocery shopping during hours where you feel like majority of the people won't be there just because you know sometimes it is convenient to go at night after work or on a weekend in the middle of the day but I feel like waiting in line is just I don't like it at all um, it doesn't feel like it is worthwhile so I choose to try to go during times where that just won't be an issue. But it does delay me getting back to the office a little bit, but I don't really care by now. And I feel like most likely people are not paying attention to that. So beautiful out. How could someone be in a bad mood? I just really hope that this persists until I get home later because I feel like I was in a rut yesterday and I watched a movie and everything but it was kind of an emotional movie so that didn't necessarily help but I got large mango green tea 
I will try my best to drink this slowly at work that way I'm not peeing constantly or feeling super bloated because of the bubbles and mango jelly but yeah I'm really happy tomorrow is my last day at work before I have my day off and then I move so things seem to be moving pretty smoothly and yeah actually Christmas is soon but I don't really care about Christmas I'm not a holiday person and I don't really have any plans for that so it will just be me and my kids as usual now I need to head back I am finally today leaving at a time where there's still some lovely daylight out and I have to say I am pretty happy today and uh, I am definitely not taking this mood for granted. Um, there has been some Dota 2 on during the day. My lovely Russian team, VP, played earlier and it was a little tragic because I had to listen to the match and then I couldn't watch any but um, they won all three of their matches. It was a best of three, but they played three games. I think it's because um, it would maybe help with no tiebreakers later on, but I'm not exactly sure. Um, there are still more games going on right now. EG is playing their series right now, and they just were, they just won the first match. I should be home by the time they start their second game, so something awesome to come home to. I'm very happy about that. Okay, I am home and it is just in time for the second game of EG versus Kingwin, some random team that I am not too familiar with, but yeah, I'm sitting in front of the TV, so I'm going to be looking up a little bit, but yeah, I mean, I guess <laughs> anytime I have plans to go out in the evening, it feels like off for me because I don't go out very often so I feel like I just have to make all these mental notes of what I plan on doing so after these games are over I'm going to pack pretty much as much as I can to bring over tonight because I'm picking up my keys and then it'll be probably really exciting to go there again because it'll make it feel all the more real that I'm about to relocate myself it would be pretty cool to bring Riley with me, but I don't really know if there's a point. Plus, I think after I bring my stuff there today, I might want to organize them, maybe, so I don't waste my trip completely just dropping my stuff off. Um, it might be hard, I guess, to organize because I don't know if I have the necessary stuff to actually properly store things instead of just throwing them behind a door or like a closet or something along those lines. Puffers! Puffers! Come here! Yeah! Someone doesn't know what's happening. Choke hold. No, I'm kidding. I'm really not doing any pressure. She's just not used to. Ooh, oh, my face! <laughs> I don't know if I want you licking my face. Oh yeah, actually. So what I was trying to say in the car, I really need to get some sort of car mount or something because what I'm using right now is this. I don't know if it is clear or not, but it's not good for putting on my dashboard it falls because of momentum and just turning and steering and stuff so i need something where i don't have to worry about my camera going flying but yeah this minor tournament is held in los angeles and it would have been really cool to go see it in person but unfortunately it's they don't have a venue for it they just play in a house but yeah, that does kind of suck that all of the American tournaments don't have a venue except TI, the international. That one, it would be cool to go next year, but I feel like it would take a fair bit of, ooh, fair bit of planning to manage something like that. It's also kind of an expensive trip, and uh, sometimes I still have problems 
or issues um, justifying spending that much money for a trip. But I think it is something that I would have to get over someday because traveling is nice and it's expensive, but I think it is definitely worth the experience and the cost is just can't help something like that. So, at this amazing salad. Oh, Panera bread, green goddess cob salad. Look at that avocado though. It's like they freaking smushed the heck out of it. But yeah, so I went to pick this up. Let me turn this around. Okay, so I went to pick this up right before I was going to drop off my stuff at the new place. So originally I was going to unpack my stuff and then bring the boxes back to bring more stuff tomorrow. But man, I think I should have just unpacked because I got a little concerned because I just remembered that Riley ended up drinking more water than usual um, right after work. So I was afraid that if I stayed there too long, then she would just have an accident and I didn't want that to happen. But now I feel like I might be a little screwed because I don't have big boxes for tomorrow. And tomorrow I was pretty much going to empty the heck out of this place. I mean, I honestly think I brought a lot already today a lot of these cabinets are now empty except some food that I uh, would bring over tomorrow. Tomorrow I was planning on bringing my computer also, monitor arms, my monitor, um, but now I'm not sure what I'm gonna do because I won't have boxes. I will think of something and also like my plates and stuff that will be kind of annoying because they're delicate and I don't have good ways to protect them. So maybe I just have to drive slow or something. But anyways, no accident. So who knows if I made the right choice or not, but um, it's eight o'clock now. I still have more time to enjoy the rest of my evening. So Hearthstone, maybe some Gilmore Girls later. I've been playing so much Hearthstone lately. It's actually kind of strange to me, but I, I'm still kind of having some fun with it. So I am three of eight right now. And it will be, I don't know, three of nine right now. So I will get nine of nine very soon. Don't you worry.